It takes many years of study and dedicated tasting to become a master of wine. The good news is that four of them select the range from Waitrose Wines Direct. The Barracuda, the tiger of the sea. Take one look at a great Barracuda's toothy grin and you'll understand why it has earned this nickname. I had a bad time after that business. I didn't go to pieces. I didn't have a breakdown. I'm not the sort of person for things like that. I know that I'm probably going to go on with roughly the same job and certainly the same personality and definitely the same name until, well, until I give up my job and old age starts to eat away at my personality and death finally takes away my name. There was a moment's silence while everybody thought... I've got a sort of idea, said Pooh at last, but I don't suppose it's a very good one. I don't suppose it is either, said Eeyore. This is John Finnamore's souvenir programme. <laughs> my dear uncle, my cycling tour continues tolerably well. The weather is unusually hot for February, but then of course it is July. <laughs> the energy, the faith, the devotion which we bring to this endeavour will light our country. Is that right? Country... Country? Sorry, it's just... The word's gone funny on me. Dear Dr. Fat Ass, go stick your head in a pig. I will do what I like, and if you don't like it, that is good, because I do not like you. I have smashed up all your science stuff, and if you buy more science stuff, I will smash that too. I, I hope you do, because I like smashing. I am a smasher. Love and kisses, Edward Hyde. <laughs> How can I thank you, myself, a humble bell ringer, to be immortalized by the greatest writer in all Uh, France? See, I have brought you a copy, the very first edition of The Hunchback of Notre Dame. The what? (laughs) And now on Radio 4, unbelievably, it's time to accidentally hear a bit of the archers again. (laughs) Even though you could swear it's only been about two hours since it was last on. You can say, oh, aren't they ugly? You can say, oh, aren't they big? You can point out that their horns look like a 1950s wig. No, the, the British public is rightly suspicious of so-called experts. And by so-called experts, you mean... I mean experts. Oh. <laughs> I can put my hand on my heart and promise that there will be no one on this jury who knows the first thing about what they're talking about. <laughs> Mansard. Why, Mansard died in a murdering accident. <laughs> Forty years ago. No, 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 no. Listen to me, Jeff. I said I can't tell you your job is safe. Absolutely not. And I never heard you say it. No, you, you didn't hear me say it. I didn't say it. Of course not. Say no more. I, I will say some more. Uh, <laughs> Piercing the veil. Do you fancy a drink somewhere, a little more private? Well... Just one drink, and then, after we've had a chat and got to know each other a little better, we can arrange to meet again. No pressure, I promise. I continued my experiments in the occult to no avail. My body was scarred and smashed a hundred times, a thousand, but I always healed to continue the journey. Do you think that you kept secrets from me? I knew everything about you. I'm tired, Jones. I've tried my best to lift the veil and been left wanting. You and I have done great things together, but now it's done. I want to finish my time on this earth with dignity. You should do the same. Now, let's begin. I began to understand that the emptiness is to be embraced, not fought. I saw an indifferent gaze, and I knew... The flesh was all, the suffering was all, the abyss was all. You should be in here. Ah, there you are. Well done. Take two elements, any two elements, say electricity and water, on their own, perfectly harmless. But when you mix them together, maybe in a bowl, dynamite! Roy steel, biff, wham, kapow! Ooh! And Lorimer Chesterfield, his mind like a lighthouse, calling in lonely myths from across the sea. My name is Sir Maxwell House. I took those two elements and like some kind of scientific blacksmith, I forged them together. Forged them into a team that would look danger in the eye and bring it down with the knowledge of a man and the fist of a man. They are the Monster Hunters! 